Yeah. <laughs> what is he? Yeah. You gonna do that? After our shift this Saturday, you want to go bowling? Sure. Why not? Yeah, we well, you need your big head as a bowling ball. All right. All right. Uh, my three-year-old niece wants a playmate that's her size. You interested? Yeah, that's what I thought you said. What was that? I don't know. Let's go check it out. Whoa, look at that. Shh. You're not here. Now everyone will know the rest. A professor almost evil! <laughs> and my assistant almost, 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 almost not quite evil assistant, aka Chip. On with the procedure. <clears throat> yes, it works! Dude, we gotta go tell Chief now. Let's go. God, I hate the Chief. Me too. Every time, every time I ever come down here, he's got a reason to shut us down. Especially for the last three times we were messed up with the same guy. Yeah, that's pretty bad. The Chief is ready for y'all now. Let's go. Chief, we need to talk to you. Yeah, I know. Sit down. <sighs> Look, my source has been telling me I know where you wear your shirt. Oh, here we go. Why y'all keep messing with Professor Evil? We're not messing around with him. Oh, uh, you remember what happened last time? We got a lawsuit and we almost got sued. Yeah, but that was last time. That, this time didn't know. Yeah, this time I know last call. call. That's what I'm just saying. <laughs> Hold on, I gotta take this call. <laughs> Chief Gordon. Is. No, Mom, I told you I didn't want the fuzzy bunny poster. I have to go by. Sorry, that was official business. But I'm telling you, don't mess around with him. He's trouble. So, oh, forget this. Fine, y'all leave. Leave. Go see where that gets you. Leave. Man, I can't believe Chief took us off that case. I know. Man, I'm so mad. I'm about to go get that guy myself. You want to come with me? That's a good idea. Go against Chief's word. That's good. Yeah. 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 <laughs> yeah. My head hurts so bad from last night. Jesus Christ. Dude, watch you going. What? Who do you think you are? Who do I think I am? Who do you think you are? Dude, I am Dr. Pepper. Look at my shirt. Doctor Why are you walking in the streets, you Dr. Pepper? It's my advertising for my business. Doctors just don't walk on streets. Now. It's my business. It's my what business. is your business? My business? All right, you want to hear about my business? Dude, I can track down anything. I can track down your stolen car. I'm sure you can. I can track down your basketball that rolled down the street and your little neighbor picked it up and gave it to their family as a Christmas present. That's true. Or... I can happen to track down a villain who's trying to turn the world into dogs. Oh my God. Why? Found it! Is that That's ironic. Does that sound familiar to you guys? Yeah. Can I help you? Yeah. Okay. Follow me, buddy. How are we going to get rid of those stupid agents? Chip. Chip. Chip! Where are you? Did you call me? How are we gonna get rid of those stupid agents? Shit. Well, why don't we just use them in a poster in my head and turn one of them into another doggy? Cause I like doggies. You know what, Chip? 
That's a good idea. But I have a better one. How about we use this potion here and turn them into doggies? That sounds like something I just said, but I like it! <laughs> As you can see on my technical spreadsheet, we are exactly right here at this dot. If we travel through this path, we shall find Dr. Almost Evil's lair. So as we take our first right here, we're going to go down the, the street, but that first house has an old lady. She just has the crabs all the time. Yeah, it just, it just makes me mad. I mean, she's always pulling this off. Oh, this is blowing my mind. What are you talking about? This is so simple. This is simple. What is mine? What do you want? Do you, do you, do you want me to get you something to drink? Because I am Dr. Pepper. I can get you a Dr. Pepper. Do you want, do you want something? Look, yeah, let's just give you Dr. Pepper. Come on, let's go. Michael, you will. <gasps> let's go, let's go. Get your, get your old. Yeah, get in here. This is freaking pop! Dr. Pepper and all doesn't mean I'm always stacked with Dr. Pepper. You can't get that mad. It's just a drink. You can't be that. Are you dehydrated? He's he got a point. He's got a point. Seriously. Are you that thirsty? You know what? You, you just want mine? Well, just take his. You can have mine. Take a chug out of here. Are you sure? I don't know. It is his and all, but. Yeah, you go ahead. I don't know. Just should you really? Just take it. If you want that bad, you need it more than I do. Michael! Dude, I told you, when we're going past the second lady, she has crabs. She's very cranky. Is yeah, it, we're still blowing your mind here. Just take your sip out of here, like, I don't care. Was it good? Okay. Well, like I said, once we get past the lady with the crabs... Dude, Whoa! Oh God. Holy crap! Michael! Michael! No! Dude! Get out of here, I'll deal with you later. I told you Professor Evil was nothing but trouble, but you still went. And look where that got you. You got your friend, nonetheless your partner turned into a dog. And it's all your fault. I'm sorry. But I still want you on this case. Pepper, come in. Sit down, Pepper. Listen, I want you guys on this case. And Pepper, I want you to take care of Josh. We can use someone of your skill in the bureau. I got you, man. All right. Now, you revenge Michael's death. Already! My name. Yes! Four! that our training is done, we must get revenge. Supporting my GPS. Evil layer should be in that shed right there. We will destroy you! What? I have one more trick up my sleeve. What's that? Turn around.
Mm-hmm.